Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I just finished my build. So this is the Ryzen 5 1600 6 core processor, which is running on the stock fan cooler. So the motherboard is B350 Tomahawk. The graphic card is Zotac 1060 M edition. That's a pair of Corsair Vengeance LPX. 3200 MAZ RAM and for the casing I use the Tegotap Lux white case back to the BIOS that CPU temperature is just very very high on the idle oh my god I don't know what was this very high temperature my room temperature is 22 celsius which is very cold and look at the CPU temperature it's just so high it's idle not full so look at that, the idling temperature is for on 40 degrees celsius, which is very nice result compared to the first one that I put up, it's on 55 degrees celsius, the difference is very big, I don't know why it, that it can keep happening, I think the bike version is unstable, which is on the 1.3 there is an update for the Ryzen 5 optimization, so maybe that's the reason. Okay, and on the profile itself, I managed to overclock to 3.8, which is I want to try if I can reach 3.9 on stock cooler. Uh, for, for voltage, I don't know. I will leave it to auto, maybe. Yeah. I don't want to try the 3200 MZ for, for the reason of stability. I don't want to try it. But then, uh, let's boot up. Alright guys, here we are. Uh, first thing that I want to tell you, voltage don't set it on, to, on auto, it will fail when you boot up. So I just set it up manually to 1350, no, I'm um, yeah, 1350 volt no, and it's stable. And look at this, it's it's remapped the lot line voltage to 13360 volt, which is very nice. That means 1350 is more than enough juice to power up your Ryzen 5 to 3.9 GHz First thing that I want to test is the temperature stability when it reaches the max temp on the max load and on the idle which is very nice 32 degrees celsius to 39 celsius degrees celsius Alright then, uh, shall we test with the CPU Z application Alright, is that good? Is it stabilized? It's already about 1 minute, it's stable on 71 degrees celsius. The result is very nice actually. This is on the stock fan cooler, I will show you. Look at this, it's red spire cooler. So the result is 3.9 on the stock cooler and it's run full load. And the max time is 72, 71 degrees Celsius, which is very nice. Considering is this is not a water cooling or a big air cooler, and it's very good. Great job, AMD. Thank you guys for watching. I know you guys want to see the benchmark of the games on the CPU, uh, but I will upload it later after this video. Thank you for watching. Give a like if you like it. Subscribe if you want to see more content from me. Thank you and goodbye.